anyways. Well, fajitos, man. Um. Well, it's good to see you. I'm glad to have you around. Well, I mean, I'm, I've, I've been enjoying you. myself, to be honest. Oh, that's good. That's good. Yeah. Okay. How's uh how's uh how's work been for you? What have you been have you been playing uh, at all? I've been uh fucking Tilly, mostly. <laughs> okay. Well, yeah. Uh, they're they're yeah. They're I I might have to talk to you about that. Oh shit. Well just so you could you could uh thank me later <laughs> when everything goes to shit, you know. I am <laughs> Do you know about that? I'm kidding, by the way. I haven't. I would not sleep with her. Well, you know, uh, have you been talking to her while you're pooping? Uh, no. Okay. All right, you're in the ground. Hello. The fuck is he saying? I don't know. He's a kidney stone. Good. Did it slurp to his brain? Like what? what? <laughs> Hello. Uh, check. Check yeah. out the two new I will get there if pieces of legislation. Okay. One is amps uh, for music. Saying? Uh, the second is for events. Um. From Moss. Does that mean that artists are gonna have new songs on? Uh, uh Ronald Rump wants to deport the kind of people. Um, sorry, I'm just taking a look at some of this just real quick. Scruffy Doodles, a liar. Investigate. The former president, he tried to kill. What the? F um, sorry. I'm just wanna. I just wanna make sure that I address because I just put out that legislation. I don't. I don't wanna ignore some of the questions that might be popping up. And um, okay, good. No one gives a shit. Any judges? Lol. Okay. Um. Okay. Cool. Uh, so you put out the thing, people are freaking out, expected, um, all right. Yeah, it's, that's pretty much it. You know, they, uh, all the BCSO, from what I can tell, headed up north pretty quickly after I made the announcement. Yeah. Um, they called Peters asked for some clarifying questions, asked if they could patrol in the city, and there's nothing in there that says they can't patrol. So I, I doubt that they read it. I don't know. Uh, well, I think it's going to be fun. You're probably going to deal with a bunch of bullshit uh, by officers that have shown zero. Um, here's how I look at it, right? And I'm going to be rather transparent, and this is no, like... Um, this police department is the worst police department in the history of Los Santos. That's why I ran for mayor. I thought we, we were doing a little no, bit better. No, it's fucking dog shit. Um, when not only did we have what was July 3rd, right? But subsequently a series of escalation by law enforcement to continue creating circumstances that only led to more violence. I was put into, I was elected on the premise that the LSPD, which I think you've been doing a fantastic job there, Moss, brought officers that had a understanding of the people that they are watching over, irrespective of what their previous criminal records are, right? Not treating them like fucking dirt. And, and that is the only way by which I think there can be any level of trust, understanding between law enforcement and the everyday person. Unfortunately, these stupid cunts up in Blaine County 
have been doing everything in their power alongside these dog shit marshals and Chief Justice Angel to try to escalate into what can only be described as a scuffed sanguine. So I'm glad a decision was made finally to separate the two, but I don't give a fuck what they think when the only time I see them down here over the last two months is a cause turmoil. So I don't buy into this bullshit about cops versus fucking criminals. That's fucking low tier thinking. It really is. I get it. You guys get shot. They get shot back and forth, back and forth. But the only people that end up paying are these fucking people running their fucking food courts or whatever the fuck. So that's kind of where I'm at with it. And I know that sounds stingy and harsh or whatever, but that's what's up. Um, no, I agree. I mean, um, Peters, I think you know more about the, the Bobby and Helen situation yesterday, but I feel like that's just a perfect example. Uh, yeah, so Bobby literally <laughs> went down to, uh, he went down to Legion Square. Um, somebody put a boot on his car. There was calls of shots fired. Did you speak up? There... Oh, yes, yeah, sorry. Uh, so Bobby went down to Legion Square yesterday. There was some sort of gambling event there. Um, and this is all, this is all secondhand information, so bear with me. Um, he went down to the gambling event. A, somebody, I don't even know their fucking name, but somebody clamped Bobby Charles' car. Uh, Bobby told him to take it off because they were getting a shots fired call and he had to leave. Um, the person refused to take it off. That's when, um... The, the, the person that clamped the car re, uh, requested a higher up. Bobby reached out to somebody. The only other officer that was a higher up at the time was BCSO. She ended up coming down and uh, did fuck all on the situation. Uh, high tower, high water, whatever her fucking name is. Um, basically cut Bobby's, took Bobby's 95, then cut her, cut him loose and uh, completely undermined Bobby and told them that uh, whatever Bobby was doing was a uh, illegal detainment. Um, I've talked to the marshals. I told Bobby, I was like, look, you need Wait, to... Wait, what? I, basically, fucking uh, a BCSO officer came in, took a 95 from Bobby, and then fucking just cut him loose. Uh, I told Bobby yeah. that I, I told Bobby I was like, look, if that's the case, if that's how they want to play, um, you need to con I, you need to do your investigation. You need to get a report ready. Then you need to hand it over to the marshals. I want to press criminal charges on her. Um, I mean, I, I I don't think it's felony obstruction, but it's definitely obstruction of justice at that point. Uh, if they want to do this fucking dumb bullshit where they're coming in and fucking with our scenes, um, um, I don't know yeah. how you guys handle this on a daily basis. Well. Like, I, I, I want to paint, like, a very clear picture here. Is shit's all fun and games with the fucking bull boots, right? And talking about splitting things up. But, y'all, this has been so fucking destructive for goddamn weeks. I mean, we're, we can't do anything because of their high command. I mean, th that's the reality of the situation. The toll booths was my idea, by the way, just so you know, in Blaine County. They got put in up there because of me. I know you had No, I'm talking about the Los Santos one. That was separate, you know. Oh, the emails? What? Uh, um, I, yeah, I mean, uh, where, no, the where's... High, the high, I, what I'm saying, what I'm saying is, like, this pettiness is over literally nothing. Which but pettiness? It, well, from like the examples that you put in, like it's fucking self-destructive. Uh, elaborate a little bit. <clears throat> well, like the Bobby situation, the Kamai one, targeting LSPD officers, looking the other way when it's a when it's a Blaine County officer. You, you have two people, literally killed. Because of Blaine County, oh, and fucking... I mean that's a whole separate thing. But I mean again, yeah. that all falls that that all boils. Down, I guess what I'm yeah. trying to get to is it all boils down to their high command, and it's like we we can't do fuck all. They're, we're literally the same rank. Fuck, I'm having one. Of the... Hey, what's going on, McNulty? No, it's like it's... No, 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 you're good. It's just SOPs and shit. 
Yeah, no, uh, I, 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 Peters, what I'm saying is I'm, I don't know how you guys have <laughs> been able to like, you know, not just like, not go like, what, what is it? Not go, uh, postal. <laughs> Saying good job, like you know what I mean. Moss, you understand what I'm oh, saying, right? Thanks. Thanks. Yeah. 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 We've, we've been doing our best, you know. Uh, I don't think you know. I, I we didn't. We've been doing our best. Uh, taking it for what it is, you know. Yeah. I, I think for me, here, here's the reality. Um, I, yeah, I don't know. The I, I will always fight you for speak the Jebs, up. the Peaches. Oh God damn it! I don't know why I keep listening. I will always fight for the Jebs, the Peaches, the Carmines, the Bobbies, the fucking uh, Vic Hannas, the the whatever. And it's like when they get shut down, like I don't know. That, that's that's my whole. Uh, I, I guess that's why I do it. You know what I mean? Like I want to like I want to see people like that thrive, and I feel like if 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 i'm not fighting for him like who's gonna fucking fight for me yep Does um that make sense? yeah kind of that's it i mean i know it... look um how you guys feeling right now it's been not uh, like i'm uh high level you think things are on the up and up i mean uh as far as lspd goes I think things with LSPD are pretty good. I mean, yeah. shift two is definitely coming around. We've promoted a lot of people. We have a lot of mm. full officers now. Uh, Avery, our PNT lead is very excited. She's going to be conducting interviews for shift two in like the next week. Um, so thing, things are, are moving along. And I think that the plan that we had set forth for shift two, you know, focus on building out the officer rank and then from there, you know, look to promote and fill out the command structure, I think is is working and it's it's been effective. Um, Shift One is doing really well. They are pretty much self-sustaining at this point. Um, Peters and I were talking about it the, what was it, last night, night before? Yeah. Um, where like, you know, Peters and I, I think both stepped back a little bit over the last week or so. Mm understandably and, vacation and all that yeah and they they've been going along you know just the same and that's how i wanted to set things up from the beginning is mm. that everything should function just the same whether or not we are we are on duty um Good so i'm really shit. happy to hear that 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 is actually what is happening you know because i think yeah. that the the thing i did not want to have want to happen was that and and i think this is what kind of happened initially within ship two is that you know uh, there there's a particular person that leads the shift right and if that person isn't around it all kind of falls apart it's like a single point of failure i wanted to move away from that and have like and basically lift up officers and lift up command so that like anybody could be a leader you know and they could sort of lead themselves and mm. i think we've been really seeing it lately um i've noticed that there's been a lot less uh oh no hammer suits against the lspd as yeah. well on the docket which has been great um like a, a significant drop compared to when i started um, to be fair, and this kind of leads to my my earlier statement, right? Is four cops literally got fired for like crossing the line? You know what I mean? And so, um, things are at a better spot. They may not be perfect, but as far as I'm aware, you guys don't have people for like kicking in doors illegally, looking through people's cell phones and doing wild shit no, at least not in the, the lspd so has that yeah oh i'm you know. i'm aware of some of it and and it's it's fucking i'm glad that it's contained well you want to hear like the crazy thing that i brought up to the marshals now multiple times and they said that they're supposedly they're going to do something about it a bcso deputy uh stole a cell phone from an unconscious deputy 
and apparently what? read through the phone. And you here here's the kicker. Oh, in addition to that, she apparently held a gun to an unconscious what 95. The <laughs> what? And she got five daps for it and didn't get fired. Are you like, bro, I like this is what I'm talking about. This fucking like bullshit. Like um you you oh know they if, if an LSPD officer had done that, you know the BCSO would have gone to the marshals. I, I'm with very aware. Forks. I mean, like I, I still go back to the fucking crashity situation where fucking Peters isn't even got done writing down in information and this guy's fucking crashing out. Um Who's crashing out? I I'm I'm You're good, I, you're good. Peters. You guys can't see this, but I have a kidney stone and I just pissed on my leg. Wait. Cryptic thing that 27 not, months. Am I crashing out? No, Wait, no. Is, am I crashing out right now? Still here. No. It's talking about... Uh, <laughs> uh, <laughs> what? Trying to snap out of it. He's talking about Cassidy crashing out. I, oh, I was okay. saying that... Yeah, she was talking about like how if... If something even remotely happened with LSPD officer, like blah, blah, blah. And I said, they yeah, do. look they at what They go Peter's to the marshals thing. literally for everything. So the marshals like understandably were uh, based on the pitching originally was ia right effectively um but I, I i was very little trust in them when i witnessed any report i gave to them being used maliciously like i fucking called out some shit from the chief hey, justice next day there's a fucking going? doj announcement <laughs> fuck out of you like it, it's it's uh the it, it, Hopefully it's gotten better with them, but they've been very clearly protecting Blaine County. Um, and, and I don't like that. I, I don't. Not not because LSPD Blaine County, but more like it draws questions of like, what the fuck is your point? Have they yeah. been helping you at least? At least like looking at things with a fucking unbiased lens? Uh, I mean, I know how you feel about the marshals, but... I will say any other than that one time, Peters, mm -hmm. you know, with that one weird guy. Um, huh? Anytime that I've spoken, there was this one marshal that we brought something to him. Craig? Is his if, name Craig? Yeah, Barrett oh, Barrett. Or yeah, Barrett's a good yeah. one. And again, uh, Barrett's the one that I reported a bunch of shit to. And next thing you know, uh, we, we this guy is fucking. Wh it gonna, gets forwarded up. I'm going to respectfully disagree with you on oh, that. Oh, no. What happened? The Barrett's not good? Uh, McNulty threatened to punch Jeb's teeth into the back of his throat. That was over... him? The one that said it's the same thing using words than to, like, threaten assault? Yeah. Bro, what the fuck? Where are they getting these fucking Timu cops but... from? In all, <laughs> all, every conversation that I've had with, like, Gallagher, um... You, you know where they're getting him. Daisy... Uh, Anna Lockhart, they've all been great. I, I don't have any complaints. They're all, they're all pretty chill. You know, they, if I have a complaint, I go to it, they address it. That's kind of it. I, I haven't felt like any kind of real bias one way or another. Recently, those are the, I those assume. Are the, oh, and Grayson. Grayson's pretty pretty good too grayson seems like a, a decent one he seems at least he's like yeah. understands grayson's, the law first grayson's handling the the cornwood stuff um which i need to follow up with him on that i think bro no fucking way barrett that barrett said that god fucking damn it yeah it was um it's it was so uh, fucking concerning. sad what about barrett daisy is... second in command miss uh no, I, I like Daisy. Daisy, um, you know, I had a long talk with her last week. Does she understand the um, law now, at least? I think Public so. documents um, are not are not illegal to read. I um. The miss, you know about the situation with her and Michael, right? Not sure. Uh, I don't know if I Michael know about getting that. shot by the docs. Oh, um, and he needs to just, I don't know, magically know that there's a fucking shootout. I, I know that G 
Gallagher was the one that was dealing with all of that. She pulled me into the office and talked to me about it. Um, I don't know what Daisy's... I mean, other than, like, being being there and being, like, a witness to it, I don't know what else she did with mm. that. Okay. So what do you what do you mean about a document? <clears throat> was this the FOIA request denial? Was it uh, that? No, the document I was talking about is uh, the uh, Sky Phase thing going around, and she oh, went into a meeting yeah. and said everyone's going to get fired if they read this because it's illegal. It goes against privacy laws in the Constitution, um, which in and of itself makes me question why anyone... I, like that should I be anywhere remotely her, near a gun. I spoke to her about that, and she acknowledged that they should not have done that. Yeah. Um, she she said that it. I don't honestly. This was like a week ago, so I don't really remember exactly what she said. But I do remember that she said that they shouldn't have done that. Yeah. But I don't. I don't want to you know elaborate further because i don't remember I exactly what she said all right well hey if it's looking better that's that's good yeah the michael situations where he was shot retrieving his vehicle drove up to uh daisy and um hayes i need to, to say call got michael it and then they and got shot apologize for not getting back to him sooner about it yeah um I think Galaga is the one looking into that one. Yeah, no, she is. She is. She talked to me about it. I'd like to see things get to a place where people just assume some level of, like, innocence and not, like, malpractice, right? It doesn't matter if it's, like, a cop or a civilian or whatever, because the reality is most people, um, I don't think are actively looking for trouble. Um, but there's just kind of, like, a countywide mistrust whether it's like lspd bcso cops civilians right and it's become very us versus them to the point that like reality and common sense goes out the window right like there needs to be an enemy um that's not something that i think i can change you guys can change but you know it's still like in dream floor right yeah so <clears throat> um Well, so how are things with you? How's um, is the the mayorship? I mean, I don't know what that would proper term is um, for that. I needed like a week off. Like I said, I had heard one too many. I need help. Um, uh, circumstances, and uh, I felt like I couldn't do anything, so I just dipped. Do, well, I'm glad you took time off. I mean, I think, I think we're all kind of in the same boat. Needed to take some time off yeah. or take a little bit of a step back. Like I was still getting on, you know, getting on duty every day and just making sure everything was fine. But you know, sometimes you just need a break. Yeah, I uh, I don't know how how much I'm gonna be around. To be honest, I think I've done my job outside of legislation. Like I said, I've got ongoing conversations with, uh, planned with the. You know the the senate let's call it um hopefully for a better tomorrow um but as it kind of currently stands uh the current state of um government structure is the antithesis of what july 3rd was about and um so you know wish me luck in regards to that but outside of that you know um you know i th think i've done what i've needed to I'm satisfied with that. <clears throat> um, That's good. Yeah. So, yeah. Well, Peters was telling me that he heard that um, Barrick Johnson might be running for mayor. Who's that? Well, I don't know if he is. I was just spreading that rumor. You were just spreading that rumor? Yeah. I thought that'd be a good rumor to spread. I don't even know if it's true or not. Uh, uh, the last chief I of police. I believed you. Oh, Barrick. That would be good. For that would be fun. San Andreas? For Los Santos? 
Yeah, I don't. I don't think it's he, true. If but, he, uh, oh, if he was running, it'd probably be for the north. Ain't nobody gonna fucking. Um, who's even gonna fucking run? Have you heard anything? I have no idea. Look, there's a lot of conversation that needs to happen. I think. Um, I have. Do you guys understand, like, uh, how many individuals I collectively on a daily basis was speaking to? Um, things have been grim, right? And unfortunately, between the most violent elements, sometimes it can look like those violent elements on both ends of the spectrum are the, uh, are the um, embodiment of how everyone in Los Santos feels. We're pretty down on a lot of things. Um, the thing that... How do I put this? I want, I want to paint a picture for you, right? And I'm not expecting you guys to fully resonate with what I have to say yet, right? Because uh, you, see, you see things from a different lens. Um, the situation with uh, JJ from, um, from the kebab shop, his story is very similar to the dozens I heard before, where this guy is friends with gang members, who is it, right? That's just the reality of Los Santos. Do you have any food, Peters? Yeah. Sorry to interrupt. He gets pulled up on. People start shooting at him. He pulls a gun to stand his ground. He is now in jail and now a felon. By his accounts, he followed the law. Is it possible that he left out details when he told me? Yes. But now he's standing here telling me, I don't know what to do anymore. I tried to do things the right way. Now I'm a felon. And I now got to hope that a judge takes my case and changes things over the next two months. When I hear stories like that, when I hear him telling me that he's just, he's, hold to his face that you're just a member of Hydra and that is the extent by which he is looked at it's depressing as shit because at that point you have to ask yourself what's left you kind of get what I'm saying so yeah uh i think it just goes back to to what you were saying earlier about you know trying to get away from just being suspicious of everyone or thinking everybody constantly has ulterior motives yeah yeah, it's uh, it's a tough one, like uh, plausible deniability, right? Assessment, all that kind of thing. I mean, at the end of the day, unfortunately, I think uh, it is a them versus us, and it's it's hard to break that cycle. It really is. Um, but you know. I think the sad reality too is there's not really an outlet. So from even your perspective, you guys kind of get fucked here, right? Because even if you've got like probable cause on everything and they have a means by which they can, um, you know, the, the reality is that they should be bringing it to court, you know, getting justice through there. But that option is just not a thing. So y'all get left holding the bag. So, I don't know. Anyways. Uh, like I said, I've done my job. I, I, I don't know if I'm going to run next election. We'll see. I think part of it uh, comes down to the conversations that are going to be had over the next, like, week or so. But uh, I just want to be rather transparent with things. Um, You know, I've... Uh, yeah, I understand. 30... Two pieces of legislation 
in two months. That's a lot. Yep. Covers just about all the bases. I don't think there's really, I can't think of anything else that needs to be written. Uh -uh. I think, um, you know, <laughs> Peters and I are just, just gonna keep moving forward like we have been. Um, I don't, you know, it was brought up to me, lieutenants in LSPD, but I told them that as of right now, I don't feel comfortable promoting anybody to lieutenant in the event that there's a new chief in a couple weeks. I don't want to, I don't want to put somebody in a position only for them to be removed from it, you know? Um, yeah, it's, uh, yeah, it's, it's kind of an unfortunate, I, I feel, how do I put this? It's kind of shitty that your future kind of relies on my mayorship, which may be part of the conversations I'm going to be having. Um, I mean, I guess BCSO is in the same boat. Andy Jones said that she wasn't going to run again. But I don't know who would um would run. I got no idea. Yeah. Yeah, we'll see. I I like I said my I uh, I think it really depends on um uh, you know what comes from the top. <clears throat> yeah. So. No. No. I, uh, don't get too doomy well, about it. I'm just like no, I no, said, no. I'm being I was transparent. Just, I was just gonna say, like, we're gonna take the time that we have and do what we can with it. Um, if we have more time, great. If yeah. we don't, you know, we, I think we all, we all went into this knowing that it wasn't gonna last forever. Yep. Um. Okay. Yep. Just keep moving forward. Yeah. All right. Easy. Peters is sitting here. What What do you think of Peters? You You see? Look, Peters. You cook? No, no. I fuck. Well, kind of. I mean, I'm in a lot of pain, but you know, uh, I'm just thinking about everything. I mean, it is what it is. That's That's it. You know what I mean? I mean, I'm grateful for I'm grateful for our time here, and it's like you know, I think that uh, we're doing the best we can. That's it. It's like you know, I don't think I could stress over it. I can't doom. You know, yeah. whatever happens happens at this point. I mean, everybody yep. here has done their fucking damnedest, and that's kind of like, like, what more can you ask, you know? Sex potties? Yeah. Freak offs, I believe, is what the uh, term is. What is it? Is it? A freak off. Oh, freak offs. Yeah. Yeah, freak um, off. You know, I think Peter's and my goal was to leave the LSPD in a better state than we found it. And I think oh, we it's done a that. much better fucking state. I'm almost. People on fucking copium. You had fucking murderers and like fucking rights violators in the body of the department. Yeah. So that's literally all we could ask for is just to it to be better than we found it. And I think uh, I think we've done that. Mm-hmm. Has um how's shit with the South Side been? Have them been popping off other than the Saints? Uh mm. Other than Is apparently the, the 14 DMC months. declaring Vespucci a sovereign nation. Love. Um, yeah, I don't I know what the fuck that is. I think things have been fine. I think everything cooled off. That conversation, I think, went a long way. May not seem like it, but I, I think it really did. I mean, we also, you know, I put out an announcement about the shit talking and yeah. all that to cool it and... Uh, I think it's really just one of those, like, and it's a conversation I've had with a couple people, right? It's, um, it, it's the give and take. If, mm -hmm. if you're bantering with somebody and they're giving it back to you, you know, that's fine. If you're, if you're bantering with somebody and they're not giving it back to you or they're telling you to stop, you know, probably just stop. It's kind of, it's kind of as easy as that. Um, yeah, yep, I agree. I, I, I think that's really what it came down to, right? Like, it's, it's kind of fucking cooked as shit. Um, 
you know, if you're using a badge as a way to escalate shit, it's fucking weird. Yeah. But, um, yeah. Well, all right. Well, listen, I'm <sighs> proud of both of y'all, so. Thank you. For what it's worth. You should, uh, you should be proud of yourself, Nino. I think, I think you've done a lot. Um, yeah, I mean, I, it's my team mostly. They, uh, I mean, even while I'm gone, they're fucking cooking. It's, it's, it's amazing. Um, and I know the people are, uh, that's kind of, that's the biggest thing on my shoulders right now is, is. I, people are, I don't know. Look, I'm going to be, I'm going to be honest with you guys. Um, I got a lot of people who've been reaching out and they're just like, do not not run next election. Cause, but like, I feel like if I don't, like I'm letting people down, but. If I do, I feel like I'm I'm saying it's okay. You get what I'm saying? I don't know. It's like a fucking I don't know. It's a lot of fucking pressure. I think um I think you have time, and I think I know you want to do what's good for everybody, but you also need to do what's good for yourself. <sighs> um. I have a, yeah have to have Tilly run as mayor, you know. Yeah, true. She she literally just gets comes in the city to shit blood, so I don't think she's gonna do it. Well, what are your plans for today? Uh, I came around just to pay bills, to be honest. Yeah, about a couple of days off the next three days. No, oh, okay. So, any, uh, yeah. Yeah, no, I'm happy. Like I said, uh, you know, got a lot done i i think we got set up for next term i just is anyone like no is genuinely nobody wants to run i don't i, I don't I know haven't I, haven't heard heard I haven't heard any campaigning i haven't heard shit oh fuck i haven't heard a goddamn thing i don't i i, I don't know like what happens if we don't have a mayor Does maybe i just become governor does the city go up in flames? I'll just get votes for both. I uh, yeah, I, I wouldn't worry too much. Like I said, I, I've got um listen, there's a lot of there's a lot of talk happening right now. Uh so um uh, Oh, here she comes. Who? And how long before, how long until she passes uh, the out from hunger? The piss father. I got food for her. Uh, I'm not sharing my food. I'm just gonna watch her I pass can't, out. I can't, I can't give her the food you gave me? No, absolutely not. It's this funnier this way. What's going on, Tilly? Oh, hey, Tilly, didn't see you there. Yeah, I just gotta think about something for two minutes. Oh, you're good, you're good. How you guys doing? Hi Tilly, how are you? Hi, I'm good. I'm fantastic. How are you guys? Good. What? What's up with the? What? What? what what's up with the down face? What down face? Everything's down great face. here. I'm good. Yeah, just yet. Yeah, I came up here, and you just you sound like you sat. Only I'm just the only tired. face I got. Yeah, the only face I got is a double down face because that's all I do is double down. All you do is double down. Uh huh. It, okay. Can you give me an example? Okay. Why are you involved in the freak offs? I'm sorry. Everybody knows you're freaking off. How did you know about that? Freaker offer. How did you know about that? Who the Medi fuck? You're not supposed to tell anybody. Who the fuck is here? Let me just pull uh... up. Do you want me to go see? I invited somebody. Okay. Yeah. Okay, I'm good. Left. Invited who? And somebody pulled up and then drove off. Yeah. I heard oh that. shit! All right. Yeah, we're just uh, talking about shit. What's going on, Tilly? Uh, you know, I, 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 
Uh, I'm just I'm hanging out, you know. Uh, you getting hey, calls? You never call me yep. back the next day. What's new? They're telling you to answer the phone, ka, on Twitter. Oh. I don't know. <clears throat> Frederick Roland, he can suck my dick. All right, go ahead. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. What, what were you calling them again? Wait, what? What what parties were you calling them? Freak off parties? Give me a sec. <clears throat> what in the fuck? Hello? Can I help you? Yeah, yeah. Uh. Hello? Hey, uh. Brother, you gotta... Are you... Is it... You using a fucking Xbox phone? You keep breaking up. Hey, cause I'm about to shoot it. Right, cause I ain't gonna lie about it. If you, I go and say real, he might be. I'm gonna just kill his ass. What do you? Hello? Hey, I cannot hear a word you're saying. You keep shutting off. Uh, hello, cut. You don't hear me, cut. Yeah. Hello? What's up? I, 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 cut. I see the last Mary and shit. So you gonna help us out with our debt, cut? We need some help with this debt, cut. They fucked us. You need to help. <laughs> the last man didn't help you. I need to help you with. Get some dick, cub? What the fuck are you saying? Uh, that nigga just, uh, I ain't gonna lie, he did talk, he did, uh, I'm out of kind of, hey, hey, Mr. Mayor, where you at, cub? Where what? you at, cub? Cub, what? What are you, I, I, brother. Cub, where you at, cub? I, not your, what, what are you, what are you asking for right now? Uh, cub, we, we need some help, cub, we need some money, cub. You we need, need a job some or money, okay? I can't, I can't help with that. But you, cub, you supposed to make change in the city, cub, you ain't, you ain't helping the cub community, cub. Yeah. You need help, cub. We need help. We out here struggling shit. You rich as shit. Help motherfucker out, cuz. <clears throat> Sorry, Tilly, go ahead. Uh, I, I don't remember what I was saying. I need you to sign uh I need you to sign this though. It's like a All know, right. it's an Let ongoing thing. I'll send it to you. Hold on. Let me uh throw it up here. <clears throat> what are what do you want him to sign? Uh a, an agreement. Hold on one moment. What kind of agreement. Let me, uh, I just have to, to get it all up here. Hold on one second. Uh, it's not is this is this is this why you need to meet so desperately uh yes i do need to meet you because of this but uh you know is that the document is that where i put this bitch oh my fucking god hello hey mr america we need to talk to you cuh listen i know you gotta talk but for the love of fucking god please stop blowing up my phone there are other people hey, in this city that I need to talk to, okay? I get it. But right now, you're borderlining hey, fucking about stop blowing cringe. Off. All right? I'm cringe? Yeah. All right, cuz. Hey, wait, wait, okay, wait, Mr. Mayor. I get it. You want to go find me, kidnap me, whatever. Just fucking pause for fucking 10 minutes. Instead of blowing up my fucking phone, you useless fucking degenerate. Fuck you and your phone, you poop. Sorry about that. Holy it's Jesus. Okay, you okay? No, these guys fucking call like 20 times over. Fucking goddamn. Anyways. Oh, you're uh, saying? Here you go. Could yeah, you go was... ahead and uh, just sign that for me, please? Me Sorry about that. That might have been because of me. Okay. It has like cross platform, right? You know what I mean? What is ERP cabinet agreement? What are you eating? Rice. Rice? Rice. Uh, yeah, could you send that for me when you get uh, when you get the chance to get it? Uh, Marshall. You know, Chavez, Tilly Winters proposed this agreement establishing that all EIP activities shall remain strictly within Los Santos and Blaine County. The agreement states that no EIP activities included but not limited to breeding kinks shall take place outside Los Santos or Blaine County. Con uh, consequences, any EIP conducted outside will result in... Los the fuck is this? 
I just need you to sign it. I need. I, I'm unfortunately. Hilly, have to be, like, I am a, not putting a, my cock anywhere near you. Across. What? What the fuck are you talking about? Yeah, Chris, I, Jesus. I, I, I'm kind of with Nino on this one. I don't think. Are you gonna? This is like a, this is like an, an, an all around thing. Could you just fucking sign it, please, Nino, for the love of God? No. So you're not gonna sign it? What is this, Kelly? What What do you mean? What, 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 what are you trying? To, I don't understand. Why, why that, are you, you doing? You sure you don't want to sign it? You I know? think you're like trying to like it, infer that, you know. I mean, tell you, you're, you're cool and everything, but, you know. You're saying that you wouldn't have sex with me? It's been almost an entire, you would, no. Listen, I had, I had this wise man, this, this old wise man, uh, mm. tell me something. What was uh, that? Ain't no pussy worth that headache. Wait, what did the old wise man say? He said, "Ain't no pussy worth that headache." Right, Be careful! I found that one. And someone was on my ass for like five years. Who was on your ass for five years? Remember, I've said something like that before. Oh. How have you been, Peters? You sound like completely depressed. No, I, well, I'm not depressed at all. I'm just in a lot of pain right now. He has a kidney stone. A kidney stone? Oh, yeah, yeah. How do you get that? Uh, too much coffee. Oh. Dehydration. What? Yeah. I mean, life's so great. It... I can't fucking complain other than feeling like somebody's stabbing me in the back and kicking me in the balls. But, you know. Is it just like a rock that comes out your penis? Yeah. Ow. That is pretty ow. I'll send, I'll send you I'll, I'll send you pictures. Oh, I, I probably, no, I shouldn't send you pictures. Do you pee around it? Do I pee around what? No, it comes out your pee hole. <laughs> it gets stuck in there? Yes, it goes through your kidneys into your urinary tract, and it it literally stabs your insides and makes you bleed internally until it comes out. What if it doesn't fit through your your? You people? have to get surgery. Ow! By the way, Tilly, I gotta apologize. I shouldn't have said that. I would I'm absolutely have sex with the outside of Los Santos. Thank you. Thank you. I would. <laughs> I'm a married man. That gave me a really warm and fuzzy feeling. I fucking. Has this been the thing that's been happening all day? Is this? Has this been like? Remember, I'm just coming in into this. Yeah. Yeah. Jesus. That's uh. I think something to laugh at. You know. Yeah. Ah, it's crazy. Well, uh, but what else was there? Like, come on, fill me in. Um, I don't know. I mean, the, uh, uh, I, I mean, it's you're saying yes, the, like it was. Come on, BCSO, like, fill me in a little bit. The BCSO, uh -huh. his, wait, his, oh, you, on that? Uh huh. I heard there's a hero out there. Hmm? Yeah, apparently there's a hero in regards to that whole thing. I don't, I don't know the guy, but you know, I just, I just shot him out. Thanks, Trav. Oh. Who? I have no idea. Trav. I don't know what we're talking about. I zoned out. Oh, it's for the best. Yeah. Well, shit. Let me see. Carmine, uh, Carmine, nine one one, anonymously. That uh, he said, "Death to the false serpent queen of the north." Uh, come on. If, if you're gonna, well, you tell him. I gotta, I gotta, it, I gotta, gotta, gotta pee in this right. I got serpent queen of the north. Thank you. Okay, you tell him the story. I gotta pee on this plane. Um, it's not really a 
really much of a story. Um, basically, I guess Andy Jones uh, increased the pay of BCSO. They were all 311-ing, you know, praising her. Uh, Carmine saw the 311s and then um, anonymously 911 uh, death to the false serpent queen of the north. Anonymously 911? Uh, yeah. In the middle of the of MRPD, uh, the BCSO freaked out, stormed into um, MRPD. Oh, hold on. Wait, what? Hey, Trig. Ah, uh, good. Just in a quick meeting. Um, no, I had um, I had somebody else. You know, I'm kind of over these BCSO fucks. Yeah, I know. <laughs> it's just like, damn. I'm glad I was gone. <laughs> I mean, <laughs> how much of that is discipling, though? You know what I'm saying? Okay. Where'd she fill you in on? Um, I, she mentioned like anonymous 911. How oh, did they know yeah, it was Carmine? Uh, 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 well, Carmine admitted to it. I, told, I said, you fucking idiot. You shouldn't have admitted to it. Um, so now somebody is going around with Santos anonymously and 911 ing yeah. uh, God, it's crazy. It's out of control. I don't know who's doing it. Um, at least three times a day. Yeah. There's a, there's a whole master doc on it. I have no idea who could be going around. Holy shit. I just, can I, I want to like point at something again. Yeah. <laughs> How much of this is. How is if someone sits down is this all because of a couple jokes and legislation that should have been never discussed like fucking hacked laptops you know what i mean like what is the source of all this uh, uh of what carmine no the, no just all of it all of it oh well i a little I bit of banter and a hacked legislation oh yeah well i do that which by the that. way i still not a single person has found out who brought it in? You know? Um, well, uh, yeah, yeah, I mean, listen, I, I do that with my eyes closed. But check me, meta chats. So, you know. No, but I'm just saying, like, what's, you know what I mean? I mean, yeah, it's 100%. I just, I, mean, I want to highlight that. Like. Um, yeah, it's, I mean, whatever. Uh, yes, yeah, 100%, that is the issue. But I think we're at, we're at a point right now where it's like, well, I it's feel like irresolvable because there is no inherent. It is ir it where is did it begin? Because it yes, can't be articulated. Exactly. So, I mean, now it's like, fuck it. Okay. I, do I mean, what am I going to do? I'll make the, the, make light of the dumb yeah. fucking situations that we have to deal with. Yeah, but that, that, yeah, but what, where do you, like, you know what I mean? Like, I guarantee uh, you that Moss drawing that line, it's going to be you and her banned them from Los Santos. Uh, that already happened. They As soon as we fucking put that line up, they literally said, we're going up to the county because we can't patrol in Los Santos. That's, they, they can't they do that. Fucking read, uh, well, they didn't even read it. It's it's fine. I, uh, the thing is, is I, we talked to the marshals, and if they're not responding to calls, like the marshals are going to be taking, well, Nova said she'd be taking uh, matters. Is their entire hand. existence just to do dumb shit all day? Like, I'm just trying to wrap my head around uh, this. I think their entire existence is to literally blow everything out of proportion. Uh, uh, okay, you know, you got to remember a lot of a lot of these people, their first job, literally their first job is a fucking police officer in Los Santos. That any other prior workforce training, um it's like they're straight out of school and they don't know how to operate in a real world setting. Yeah. Uh, such as the Los, Los Santos Police Force Department and uh the their go-to is um let's freak out over the dumbest shit possible so now i i, I don't know i mean what are, you, what are you gonna do it's like like seriously I, when when you told me i was too nice you were you were 100 percent right and now it's like fuck it okay let's just let's just let's just, they just like waiting fucking lean into everything so yeah i just uh, that, that's kind of like the heart of it is um 
none of this is remotely sane. <laughs> like, these are literal, like, like Walmart workers who are given like a badge and a gun and position. And the, the it's, it's so like middle school drama that well, don't say I cannot that. fucking don't see that you're doing a disservice to Walmart workers. <laughs> okay. But, but I'm just like, how is this still happening? I'm just, just fucking, my mind is literally just, yeah, I, I, I am so glad I'm not having to deal with this. They just keep, they don't want to stop. They just fucking keep sensitive it. Sally's, you know? Jesus Christ. Um, well, I'm I'm glad I'm not in, uh, having to deal with this, Peters, but I'm glad, you know, you're slapping the dick down and whatnot. Um, yeah, I mean, fuck it. We got to have fun. You know, wh wh why are we even here? You know what I mean? I, uh, it's. I mean, I just say build the fucking wall and make them stand yeah. inside. Probably should have done it to begin with instead of jokes. <laughs> I was never joking. I know you weren't joking. I was never joking. Yeah, well. Okay. I was just on the I phone like, with Trey. Why the fuck not? You know what? Like, mm -hmm. why the fuck don't we just do that? Like, and tell them they can't patrol here. Uh, no, no, happy, no, no, no. Well, well, hold on. I was just on the I'm phone sorry. with Trig, and I asked him to look at the legislation, or the the announcement I made because there's a section about um, ISO in it, and. Yeah. Um, he said, he read through it and he said that he thought that it was great because the other day somebody came into MRPD to turn themselves in for a warrant and BCSO snatched him up and got the $150,000 fine. Hmm. It's so, so like, I don't know how to put this, but like the, these guys are not cops. With all due respect. <laughs> I, uh, like, I think like we said in the car, or I said in the car, I don't know if you heard me. At this point, I'm just looking out for my own. And my own is LSPD. I don't give a shit about BCSO. Yeah. No. I literally couldn't care less what they what do or the don't fuck? do. They're not, they're honestly I don't, I don't think that they the... should be in this country. I don't understand why we're still like, uh, giving them leeway i don't, I don't understand it Why well are still allowing i mean them moss is going? already Mo, it, what you missed here is moss put out the uh separation of of things i, I mean the she? thing is they've been given the this is why the like you know the, i get the the marshals have been okay they encouraged all this so it's hard for me to chop it up any kind of way but uh that's my personal feelings i don't expect you guys to subscribe to that <clears throat> um anyways i don't want to keep you guys too long look i'm gonna be around uh i'm gonna be out the next like three days probably but uh, if you need me send me an email or whatever i'm not gonna be around but uh <clears throat> i'm gonna be okay. pretty in and out i hope your uh i hope your talks go well oh yeah <sighs> yeah i think they will okay yeah anyways uh, do you need a ride, Nino, or...? No, I should be good. Oh, yeah, I do, actually. Do you have a vehicle? I got one. You do have one? Okay. Yep. All right. Well, nice to see both of you. All right. Um, yeah, likewise. See you later. I'll see you guys, okay. All right. All right. You guys all right. be safe, all right? Good night. Good night. Since when did BCSO just turn into a bunch of shitlords? They've been this fucking way. They, yeah, it's just they, fucking...